The Neuro Recovery Network is a cutting-edge rehabilitation program for patients with spinal cord injuries. It's funded by the Christopher and Dana Reeve Foundation and the CDC. So far, 20 patients at Kessler Institute have used it since its introduction 10 months ago. NJN News health and medical correspondent Sarah Lee Kessler reports. Don't let the trunk go with the leg, okay? Try and separate it out. 56 year old Jerry Fortunato is a patient in the Neuro Recovery Network program at Kessler Institute in West Orange. NRN uses an activity based approach called locomotor training. Two technicians move the paralyzed patient's legs to simulate walking while the patient is suspended in a harness over a treadmill. A third technician supports the patient's hips. The first amount of independence you want is the head, the neck and the trunk. We concentrate on that first and then we work down, so it's a top-down system. <laughs> Fortunato, who's been paralyzed for nine years following removal of a benign spinal cord tumor, says NRN has begun to give her trunk stability, enabling her to start using a walker more and a wheelchair less. I can stand up, which is just kind of a really nice feeling. <laughs> I was always fairly tall. It's nice to be able to look down again. According to some spinal cord experts, this type of therapy can promote the growth of healthy nerve fibers in certain patients who have some muscle tone or movement in their legs. Activity-based therapy is really retraining the spinal cord of the nervous system how to learn to walk. It's awakening dormant pathways within the central nervous system. That's good. Good job. job. 25-year-old David Schlossberg is an ideal candidate. He suffered what's called an incomplete spinal cord injury in his mid-torso after his car was struck by a drunk driver four years ago. He's now able to walk briskly with a cane. It helps them to be more independent with daily tasks, such as getting in and out of bed, climbing up and down the stairs to visit relatives or friends, and getting in and out of the car to return to work. In Schlossberg's case, that means resuming his career as a professional pianist. Now I can sit straighter, I have more endurance at the piano, and also um, the NRN program is helping my right foot so that soon I can switch from my left foot, which was compensating, to playing like everyone else does. For the longest time, you live with it, and you think, you think that's, that's it. And now, with, this, with the NRN, I, I can do things I never thought I could. Sarah Lee Kessler, NJN News, West Orange.